Welcome to the Lakeshore Total Test training videos. In this series, we will cover Concur Solutions expense reports. Right now, we'll be covering itemized expense reporting for lodging. You'll start by logging your Concur Solutions page. You'll click on the new expense report. Enter in the required fields. Choose the appropriate date and any comments you'd wish to relate to your manager, the company, and the project you would like to allocate this charge to. Click on the next button and you'll scroll down until you find lodging. In this case, hotel. Expense type, hotel, transaction date. Purpose, vendor. From this drop down menu, you can choose various hotels that you might have stayed at. The city, I've already entered in Miami. The type of payment, and the amount. You can change the company and the project at this point if you'd like, and add additional comments. Now, if you wish to itemize this receipt, you click on the itemize button right here. And from here, you can enter in the amount of days you stayed. Let's say you checked in on the 30th and you checked out on the 2nd. You spent two nights there. The rate of the room, let's say it was $100, had some other expenses that costs you 25 each night and we will call it just business meals now these are what you heard each night you save the itemization and from here you can see that there are red flags these red flags constitute that there is some missing information once you click on the red flags it will give you a chance to fill in the blanks. If you forget to save, the system will prompt you to save or not to save. In this case, we will save. You will have to go into each allocation individually. Let's say you worked on multiple projects and the second night was dedicated to a different project. You can enter in the train, the business purpose, and you can click the allocate button right here. This will pop up another screen which will allow you to choose where this release will go. Let's say this one was for toll test and the project was USC removal. Click save and it will allocate this one to a different project for you. Scroll down and the last one is business meals. And this one you can also allocate. To quickly fill in the fields you can choose a code that you have pre previously used. In this case we'll use the UST removal in Newport. It will automatically populate the company and the project, the organization, and the code. Click Save. Click OK. Make sure you enter in all the required fields, and then click Save. As you can see, the red flags are gone. The yellow is just a warning for something that is out of place or out of the norm for the system. It will just usually require you to enter in information or messages for your manager. Once you are done with this, you can submit your report by clicking this button on the top right 
and it'll prompt you to add receipts, print, or view receipts. This is where you can submit the report as is. We will cancel out because we wish to add additional receipts. You can add receipts by using this drop down menu, attaching receipt images from your computer, or you can do printing or emailing receipts directly into the system. For fax receipts, you will click on this button and it'll pop up a fax cover page that you will print out and fax in with your receipt. This page is fairly self explanatory and will guide you through the process. Once you're done printing, you click this button and you'll close out. And you can choose to submit your report. Or if there's any changes you wish to make, for example, deleting certain charges or expenses, you can do so. In order to delete an itemization, you'd have to go into the charge itself and go through it, or you can delete the entire expense. Confirm. And that will clear out your expense report. If you wish to delete the entirety of the report, you click on the delete report button, confirm, and the entire report ceases to exist. Once you're done with the system, you can click on the logout button and that will take you out of the system completely. Confirm. And you have successfully logged out of Concur. Thank you very much.